Welcome back to the Court of the Penitents in Pillars of Eternity. We're very far in chasing Thayers. Or at least we think we are. And now, first, let's do some level ups. We have enough experience to level up on three characters on level 11. Or up to level 11. And yeah, it's a very rare opportunity that we can do that. So I have thought long and... and uh, <laughs> thought very long about it and let's see what we can do we have our bard here and like the chanter Vicastine. i'm using her mainly as a tank so she'll get some athletics more second wind which is very very helpful like in the in the case of emergencies that is also endurance is very good for tanks like they they won't lose that much endurance and 65 endurance pretty good like in the case of an emergency that will save her so what are we going to do next we're going to get a new phrase for our songs we have the choice between a philoth we're smith fir with a burning effect on all ally weapons that's too specific for me like there's many creatures immune to burn damage also the dragon thresh the dragon whale that is basically a a hazard field so creating burn and slash damage lingering around only to enemies but i don't think that's much damage and we have we haven't skilled her to do damage much so we're going for seven men onto the deck they went helping our friends to survive encounters even more like a bonus to freeze and shock damage like reductions and a bonus to defense against the prone affliction which is very very helpful freeze and shock are like the the main things that we are being attacked in the court of the penitents with these adra animates and uh, freeze is a common attack for the undead so i think this will help us right now and the 15 defense against prone attacks is always very helpful so we're going to do that our 11 level 11 chanter very good she's pretty sturdy also now let's go for a ranger what will help her well we want her to <laughs> do all the scouting so we'll raise her stealth and we're getting a new ranger ability the ones that are new are all usually down here so these are the more uh, important or more dangerous more powerful ones so stunning shots seem pretty nice but it's only when the animal companion attacks the same as she does so um what we really had problems with in this playthrough was the bear even if it's a tank pet like with a bear going down so we want to revive the companion um, like for the bonus um, our Kailvasa gets when the companion is alive, that is a very helpful thing. Even if it's only once per rest, I think that's good. Because the bear will only go down in the very tough fights and then <laughs> it will be when we need that. And that is usually only once per rest because after a big fight <laughs> we will usually rest. So we'll go for revive companion which is very powerful already have heal companion so she's a companion ranger right now <laughs> and gerstein duskwalker a wizard a wizard what will we go for with her now I've, I've i've thought much about this and i think we want the accuracy bonus versus the creature type so we'll increase survival by two and have that thing going for us when we rest because she's ranged she can really she can really use that she doesn't need the damage reduction that much so that's what we'll do and spells they are very powerful spells you can see here minor letters one of the classics it's centered from the caster pierce damage bypassing damage reduction very nice but it's it's very specific it's pierce damage so don't really want that also like around the caster we want we want to use it like far away from her if that's possible we have the gaze of the adragon it's also like 
area of effect based on the caster and it's only a small radius so it could be nice to save her but really we have the shield that should be enough we have the death ring also it does corrode damage it isn't it isn't really bad but it's also radius from the caster like that's not that's not what we want here Sitzal's martial power but really we have enough dealers of physical damage with us so if we wouldn't have a ranger this would be a very good spell of course but mm, no we, do, we don't need that we have our ranger and she can yeah she can do something else what will she do she'll do a chain lightning caster calls for the tremendous bolt of electricity that arcs directly to a single target and then jumps between up to six nearby enemies that sounds oh, totally awesome others in the area of effect are not harmed by the arcane lightning so that's a controlled chain lightning not the one like in baldur's gate which would kill all of you uh, all of the enemies then all of you does a lot of shock damage jumps on targets and does the same shock damage and has reflex <laughs> yeah that's totally pretty good it has a pretty high range for the spell and a pretty high range for the jump as well so it's going to be totally helpful we're going to take chain lightning and archimedes capricious hex what does that it unleashes a volatile hex upon enemies in the area of effect causing them to become either dazed sickened or paralyzed depending on its own mysterious whims they sickened and paralyzed that is very very good the area of effect is very high and you can place it somewhere so that is going to help in a in a chaotic situation that is going to be a trump card to have the enemies dazed when they are dazed you can kill them like there's no tomorrow same goes for paralyzed and sickened uh, all attributes reduced by one that is just a little help so that's going to be our spells that we're going for now the spell mastery i'm always thinking about taking the merciless gaze in the spell book but really it's too specific to have it in the spell book but it's pretty good to have it as a one thing in the fight 15 percent of hits that also goes for spell hits not only for like that shot with a with a wand to crits for 70 seconds so doing that at the start of the fight will be pretty pretty great and we're going for that merciless gaze then so now let's explore more as the you wish. sun in shadow maybe we'll find more secrets let's see we've found the guardian's dome what's in there more souls for us or an event no it's like what and with and shades coming at us and some kind of thing here that is not yet discovered wow that's a lot of shades we have to defeat our own souls look at that pillars they are coming al alive and there's a shadow drake flying in what the hell Adonan can you please go and, and tank the shadow drake I feel no one else will survive it if we Christine here she can go for that ink with and shade that's no problem and here here oh uh, what are we going to do I think I want the Arcane Whale <laughs> instantly. <laughs> what else? What else? Uh, I want to kill that shade. Quickly, or, or that one rather. I have Lord Paul. Lord Paul should go tank that shade. We have Quarrel. What can he do? He can just go for a Holy Power, or he can stop these guys. Oh, I think the holy power would be something pretty good here so let's go for that mm. we 
Castine already has something to do. Lord Paul also. Adonan too. Yeah, well, that's what we'll do. Quickly. Let's go. Shield already. Now oh, let's go for the essential phantom. Shadow Drake. Oh man. This is going to be a pain, probably. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, you can stay here. You're in the way of the Shadow Drake. Whom does he target? He targets Wickestein. Can we throw him down? No. We should put the defense on. God, look at this. Ah, it's, that will be a pain. Kavaba, Vikastin, go for it. Oh. Yeah, this is going to be hard, probably. Let's maybe do it quickly. Let's line that thing. Why is that shade walking around here like a madman? Uh, and what do we have to do here? Ah, uh, we have the... The duplicate. We have quarrel going on here. Go for the blessing. Go for the arcane assault, please. Quickly. Oh, yeah. We want a merciless gaze first. And maybe we want something stronger now. Prayer against bewilderment. That will help much. Mm -hmm. Oh! Now, that's much better, right? Go for these spells. Kavava, you need to kill them today. I hope Adonan can do this. Mm, let's help him a bit. Have the champion's boon. Lava room. We are... Want that on him? <coughs> and then we want the blessing. And we want more spells. Still alive! I can hold. Yeah. Oh, sure. Something we can kill. Why is Wickersteen just standing there? Come on. Ah. Yeah. She, she has the... That weapon on. Oh, God. That, that thing... Oh, it's going for Lord Paul. That's good for us. Let's finish these shades. The finish is an often overlooked ah! What else could we go for? Hmm. I think Adonan is holding pretty well. How long is it that the champion's boon is going to be there for a while? That will help much. Oh, the, the shade has now targeted Kalvasa. That's not good. Change the weapon. Yeah, you guys finish that thing. Crowns for the faithful. Wow. Yeah, we have new spells here. Going to be pretty awesome. For now, we want uh, maybe the Dire Blessing. Uh, Lava Room! Hmm. 
what do we want now? The missiles, yeah. Let's just go for that. Why, why is Kavava here? There's nothing here. Love to walk in here a bit and go for the shade. I'm here. Need to flank that shade, that would be much better. They're walking around so much, I hate it. <laughs> ah, but now. Stop the party! There we go. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Christine going for that shade. Duplicate as well. Kevawa doing what he can, yes. killing shades. They're badly injured. They have a weakness against them. We should change the weapons. What is that? That's a beast. Hmm. We don't have any beasts, anti-beast weapons here. Fortunately, but we can well. change that. At least now. It's a good thing. Now, let's go for that shade, right? can flank the dragon with Lord Paul. But he's afraid, isn't he? He was for a short time. Mm. Ah, now can change weapons. Attack the Shadow Drake, also mark him as prey. Christine can also run yes. here. Now everyone attack the Shadow Drake. Everyone. Oh, come on! Attack the Shadow Drake, come on. Let's try something else. Now come on. Continue, please. You need to attack it. Yeah. Even if it's on our side, or even if it looks like it. Yeah. And we killed it! We killed the Shadow Drake. Well, that was an encounter. <laughs> Pretty surprising, yes. but we did good. We did, ex we did really excellent. Adam and tanked it all. So, um, uh, what will the Drake have as treasure? We're going to see in the next episode. And we're also going to see... Hmm, what comes after that in that mysterious shadowy area here? Ooh. Thank you for watching. Uh, subscribe to the playlist or to the channel if you want to be informed quickly when new videos come out. Um, I'm really, I'm loving Pillars of Eternity. <laughs> I'll play it all to the end, like we're not even at the wide margin, it's already over 200 episodes, we're not missing many quests, so if you're interested in that, in Path of the Damned gameplay, <laughs> blind as well, then, then I'd be pleased if you joined us. So happy gaming to you, and see you in the next episode.